like 40, and I just, I lose my grip. And I just go slammed into this parked car like, dude! Oh, yeah. hey, 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 keep it down, I'm gonna and, kick your friends out. And I look down and my ankle hey, is yeah. literally hey, just Phil. twisted backward. No. Focus up, buddy, you gotta talk about your leg. There was significant muscle damage. There was also some extensive damage to the arteries and the nerves. We're not out of the woods yet. We still have to make sure that you can reestablish full perfusion. Yes? Um, doctor, I am high as a kite thanks to this wonderful drip that you have me on, and these guys took some Valium in the waiting room, so nobody knows what you're talking about. <laughs> you shredded your leg, so we need you to stay here for a day or so. Okay. Okay, well, I'll check in on you later. What up, sexy nurse? Maya? Baby, can you give me some magazines or something? I'm bored out of my mind. Okay. Thank you. Um, be right back. Hmm. She's gonna be gone for at least 20 minutes, so there's time for you and me. You better be nice to that girl or she is gonna walk. Where is she gonna go? You know, I married a guy like you. And this whole arrested development, I am so cute and stupid routine does not wear so well when you're 30. You have a fever. And you're still married to him, aren't you? Exhibit A, B, and C. I rest my case. You're an idiot. And you're married to an idiot, so who's a bigger idiot? You okay? Yeah, just a little woozy. Can I get an extra blanket? My foot's cold. Cold? Is it numb, Phil? I don't know, maybe a little bit. Can I have some, maybe some water? Hey. I need some help in here. Phil. Yep. Hi, Phil. You uh, lost consciousness. We took you to surgery. There was uh, severe damage to your popliteal artery. We tried several different anastomoses. The vessel wall simply wouldn't hold. When we couldn't reestablish blood flow, we had no choice but to remove your leg below the knee. Or you would have died. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. It's right here. <laughs> oh my God! What did you do with it? What did you do? Where is it? What? Get off of me! Where is it? Why don't you just try a little physical therapy today? Listen, I served in Iraq. I saw a lot of guys who lost limbs. This is not a game ender, especially since you still have your knee. Can't even look at that ugly stump. I'll look at it. Let's look at it together. No, don't touch me. Where's my leg? Excuse me? My leg. Where is it? You guys just took it. Nobody asked me. Is that what this is about? I don't want you in here. You don't like me. I don't like you. I don't want to hear your stories about Iraq or whatever. I just want to be alone. Can you get out of here, please? Just leave. One hardcore crazy bitch. You said you wanted to see it. I said that in a fit of rage and sadness. What is the matter with you? That leg is just skin and bone, you know? It helped you, but then it had to come off. It would have killed you. You're here and here. You're still you. It's gonna be okay. I know it doesn't seem like it, but it is. I'm still an idiot. A little bit, yeah. Yeah. Let's look at your leg now. You ready? I have a 
stump. I prefer the term nub. This is your body. It still works. You just have to get used to it. The prosthetics are crazy now. There's some seriously bionic stuff out there. Can I keep my leg? No. Why? Because it's gross and it smells bad. Well, what are we going to do with it? Would you like to say a few words? Left leg. The first time I remember thinking about you was when Todd hit you with that dart. Oh, that hurt. So we kicked him in the balls. And I remember like climbing trees, running away from cops, wearing flip flops. You were a good leg, really good. I wish I hadn't done that stupid thing the other day, but I did. And I'm sorry, I wasn't taking care of you. It's hard. You know that uh, phantom pain thing? Like where you feel pain in your leg even though you don't have a leg? Yeah. But I don't like that idea, that freaks me out. So I'd like to just be able to say goodbye now and have that be the end of it. Do you think that's a possibility? Yes, yes I do. Okay. Just toss it in the... Oh, God, no, 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 no. This is just a symbolic gesture. We're taking it back to bio waste. It gets trucked out of here. There's, you know, zoning laws about burning human flesh in cities. Right, because the smoke gets into the clouds and then it rains and the people become zombies. Yeah, that's totally right.